topic, Circle of Life. Circle of Life by Toastmaster Harris. Those days, going to Rosie's house was an exciting experience. Just the way uh, coming to Toastmaster's session as exciting as today. I used to take my nephew along with me uh, whenever I wanted to go to Rosie's house on that particular day <coughs> when I went to exchange chemistry, with, uh, chemistry notes with Rosie. <laughs> this guy opened his mouth and said, Uncle, shall I ask Rosie to serve some tea and discuss to me? so that you get a little more time. She started looking at me like this. I know this guy not only know that I got skeletal, but the whole graveyard in my cupboard. Good evening, Toastmasters, friends, and culture. Objective of my speech here today is to tell you about my humiliating experiences that I had with these kids. Well, that's what I wanted to say today. Take my advice, you need to tell, teach your kids how to behave. Take my advice, I don't need it anymore. My brother-in-law took my advice very seriously and he told his son that behave. He was expecting his friends to come that evening. The moment the doorbell rang, he ran and opened the door and said, Papa, yesterday you were telling mommy, you no, know, that your friend who got married nine years ago who don't still have kids, they have had. <laughs> My brother and my sister, they bowed themselves inside the kitchen sink like I would have told. You know what might have happened. Well, my circle of life took a different turn when I got married. I thought marriage is a word, only then I realized it's bigger than a paragraph where each and every sentence ends only with a question mark. <laughs> and life took a different turn when my wife started disappearing. You don't have any other idea. She started disappearing for the kidney part. I said, I have no other option but to learn how to cook. Most of the men out here, they think making sandwich is actually cooking. Yes, I wanted to learn how to cook. I said, can you please help me how to make the sandwich? She said, it's very easy. You just have to take four slices of bread, put some butter and egg, and put it in your toaster, and then, hey, 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 wait, wait, wait. What if it burns? No, I mean, no, no, what if it smoke? No, 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 if you have anything, you can call me. That evening, she disappeared. My little one, Isha, had two issues. One, you all know, most of the times, loose motion will not come with a slow motion. <laughs> and at the same time, she declared, Papa, I'm hungry. I took those four slices and put some butter and the egg, put it into the toast master, sorry, toaster. <laughs> and then, nothing was happening. I called my wife. Hey, honey, please help me or I don't know how to make this. She must have gotten embarrassed because she was with her friends. I said, well, hey, please help me or nothing seems to be coming. It's okay. No, 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 I really need to know I'm very hungry. It's okay. I love you. No, 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 please help me or I love you. Come. Well, it will not make you a Christian just if you go to a church as much as make you a car if you stand in front of a garage. Just the way I was looking at those four slices and the toast, I was wondering whether I could become a toastmaster or a toaster, whatever you call it. <coughs> then these four sandwiches, they came out and I served it. Just then I had changed her diaper. She started eating. A little while later, my wife, she came and said, what? You're eating sandwich in your diaper? No, ma'am. No, I'm eating it in my hands. <laughs> well, I was least bothered to know what's happening there. I, I just wanted to eat because I was so hungry. My little one, she asked, Papa, uh, are these mosquitoes good to eat? Listen, this is not the time you should be asking. She kept quiet. After I finished eating my sandwich, she said, What? Why do you ask the question? No, I said, can do it. No, no, tell me, why do you ask the question? No, it was there in your sandwich, now it's gone. <laughs> why do we say no offense when we are about to offend somebody but kids? They don't even think about saying it in your mind. My circle of life took a different turn to a greater height when this little Isha always used to say, Who are you? I'm a first Well, my wife, she corrected her and gave her beautiful insight. That evening when I took her to the Kukrevi Lake, 
my friend Dinesh who was jolly, he came and said, Hey, Alan, do you have this data? I thought so, but Mama says I'm not. <laughs> well, I have no other option but to scare her away, you know? Come on, do you know this lake? There are alligators out there. You know, alligators, she started crying. <laughs> what if they eat you? <laughs> my heart. No, 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 no. That's why I don't. Now what will it be? Who's going to drive you home? <laughs> well, my circle of life, I wanted to push it inside the alligator's mouth because I don't want it to come here. But I picked up the courage to walk up to the hero of the stage to give it to you. I'm glad that I have brought the fake smile with this uh, broken soul and you guys picked it up and gave a wonderful smile. Oh, do you think? Thank you.